Hi designers, welcome to the final video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to save your image, your final image. So up until now, every time you have saved this sheet of work, you have been saving it as a Photoshop file that preserves all of these wonderful layers you've been creating. In order to save your final design, you need to actually flatten this image. You don't want to save all of these layers on top of each other because if you don't flatten the image to make it all into one layer, then you can't save it as a JPEG or a PDF or anything like that because JPEGs and PDFs are all flat files. They don't have layers in them. So to do that, we simply go up to the top of your screen. You will see um, on the menu there is an option there called Layer. Click on that come all the way down and there is an option there which says flatten image. Notice when I click this, all of your layers are gonna disappear into one layer. You ready? Flatten image. It says here, do you wanna discard the hidden layers? Those ones, it's referring to the ones that I haven't toggled the visibility on. Yes, I'm okay to disregard and discard those. Okay, there you go. Now it is just one, image and it's called background and that's it now once you've done that that doesn't mean that you still can't keep working on the image there's plenty of things you can do if you want for instance i just realized i really don't like that um bit of orange in the ear so if i wanted to change that even now i can still work on it i just go to the magic tool i select that bit of the ear okay then i just go to my color i actually feel like i want it blue and I go to my paintbrush and I just paint that in there. Now all of a sudden it's blue. Command D to deselect. Yeah. So you can still work on it. It's just that you're not you're not using your layers anymore. All right. So once you are happy with your design, you have flattened your image. Then you can just go up to File, Save As, and in this menu you will need to go out and select JPEG. Okay, so it changes it up here. You can call it Hippo, JPEG, and then hit save. It's gonna to save to my desktop and okay. All right, and there's my final image saved to my desktop. Well done, everybody. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Enjoy.